the next thing we're going to do is we're just going to talk about a few of our setups for our arm drag. Um, in our drag double video and our drag single video, we talked about our positioning for what we're doing with our arm drag. Now we're going to talk about how to set up our arm drag. Now, what, like we talked about, the traditional position is I'm just going to control this wrist. I'm going to put my hand in the armpit. I'm going to pull it across my bot. All right, that's our most basic setup to our arm drag. But as we get into it, we, uh, we can find ways to disguise this arm drag and to set it up from different positions. We don't need to control this wrist every time. Um, so our first one is this guy is going to be controlling my wrist. Now with this arm, other side please. With, so he's controlling on that same side. He's got my wrist. I, I'm gonna clear this wrist and at the same time, I'm gonna drag to a head outside drag, all right? So we talked about how we have our, our head inside drag and our head outside drag. And they're doing two different things for us. They're setting up different finishes. So this one, I'm gonna clear wrist tie to a head outside drag. Now, when I'm doing this, I'm going above the elbow because my goal is to kind of uh, attack at this elbow joint. I'm trying to hyperextend this elbow a little bit. So the hand that's controlling my wrist, I'm gonna push into him. This other hand going above the elbow and that's gonna force a lot of pressure on this elbow. That's gonna clear that tie. It's gonna clear the wrist and it's gonna allow me to get around the corner here. So he's controlling my wrist. I'm gonna go high in the arm here, above the elbow. I'm gonna extend his arm, push his arm to the center of his body and I'm gonna take a step inside, get my hips tight to his. Now I can either attack his hip, I can drop into my double leg, um, but the important thing is, is I'm clearing this wrist tie and I'm establishing this good, close, tight hip position on this one. So he's controlling my wrist, going above the arm or above the elbow. It doesn't have to be all the way up in the armpit this time. In fact, I encourage us to go just right in the middle of the tricep here. I think that's the position where we're gonna be able to get the most pressure on this elbow. And I'm gonna step, and at the same time as I'm stepping, I'm clearing the arm. So top hand come toward, comes towards me, far hand goes away. I can either attack far hip, or I can drop into my double leg. All right, and that is our clearing wrist tie with an arm drag.